Last Saturday, North Dakota got the better of visiting North Dakota State in Grand Forks behind several individual performances. Running back Gavin Zebarth of North Dakota earned the league's Offensive Player of the Week honor after he rushed for 156 yards and three touchdowns. He had a 59-yard touchdown run midway through the fourth quarter that put the game away, bringing the score to 49-17 with just over seven minutes remaining. Luke Skinoka of UND helped the Fighting Hawks set the tone as he took the opening kickoff 100 yards to give UND a 7-0 lead with just 13 seconds into the game. He finished the contest with three touchdowns, with a touchdown reception and a rushing touchdown. In another league game that featured two ranked Missouri Valley teams, place kicker Will Leland of South Dakota made a 41-yard field goal as time expired to lift the Yotes to a 34-31 win against visiting and nationally ranked Youngstown State. Elsewhere last week, Jacardia Wright of Missouri State had a career-high 163 yards on 22 carries and scored two touchdowns in the Bears' route at Western Illinois. Mark Gronowski of South Dakota State helped the Jacks to their 20th straight win as he connected with eight different receivers in the blowout win against Northern Iowa. He had two touchdowns to tight end Zach Hines, and Gronowski also rushed for a touchdown for the 11th consecutive game. The Salukis got back on track with another win as running back Justin Strong finished with 128 yards on 14 carries, including an 80-yard touchdown run on the first play from scrimmage. And quarterback Zach Anakstad of Illinois State put together his best all-around game as a Redbird in the team's 44-7 homecoming win over Indiana State. He set a career high with four touchdown passes and recorded a career-best 79 rushing yards in the win against the Sycamores. For the Missouri Valley Football Conference, I'm Jim Powers. Have a great week, everybody.